pretty early in the morning, 7.30 actually, on a back way from Tiffin to Bettsville. And you put the windows down, turn down the AM radio that you're listening to, and just check out nature. It's actually beautiful. Hear the water of the creek. Looking for deer, eagles, falcons, anything I might see. Just awful, awful darn beautiful. Put the heat up a little bit on the floorboard. And just take in the quietness of the countryside on a January 21st, 2015. Quiet, light snow morning. It was snowing noticeably earlier this morning on the way into Tiffin. Not so much now. Quiet graveyard at the Shiloh Church. And just a beautiful setting. I like taking the back roads. Stay off the highways where the people are always wanting to go too fast. Too much in a hurry. Don't necessarily like the sun shades with the camera to record, but it's better than being distracted. Just a beautiful setting. As much as I prefer summer and autumn and spring, there are times, like this morning, that I can appreciate winter. So for some of you, my friends, out there across the country and the world, and when I say world, I'm thinking of Timmy B in China. Here's a little Northwest Ohio winter, early morning winter. And since there's no traffic whatsoever, I can turn these lights off for a minute, give you more of what I actually see. Beautiful, 7.30 in the morning on a snowy Northwest Ohio winter morning. All right, lights back on. Back on the road to home. Free up. I knew I left this in pause for a reason. I don't know if I captured it, but was a falcon, possibly an eagle, flying across the sky there. I just am intrigued by wildlife. Both kinds of wildlife. What I'm looking for now and the kind my brother Doug <laughs> has more experience with than I do. 
usually in the evenings there's a very good chance you're going to see deer run across this road in front and behind you and across that field. T and I have seen them many, many times. Unfortunately, not right now. Beautiful old brick structure here. Been here, as you can probably guess, when and if you see better pictures of it. And I've got a lot of them. Brick structure from many years ago. Don't know what it was built as originally or what it's been used for since. Just a beautiful brick structure. And then a little later up the road, we're here at the old former Harrison's Tavern. Before that, I believe, immediately, or at least sometime before that, was DeMuth's Tavern. Near Old Fort and Bettsville, Ohio. And right next door to what used to be Basic Incorporated, which is now MGQ. Maple Grove quarries. Quite an operation nowadays. Between the quarries operation and the blacktop company M&B Asphalt, quite a uh, boom in business. One of my first jobs out of high school was down there where that green light is in the scale house. My dad had worked here for many years, helped me slide into that position of working the scale house on a 3 to 11 shift. I had initially had plans to attend Terra Community College or Terra Technical College and work there, but love got in the way and that didn't quite happen. Ah, let me put an asterisk there. What um, I thought was love at the time. Yeah, need an asterisk there. little further up the county road and around the S curves approaching the Stanley Miller farm for many many years and still there's a shot across the field of basic incorporated many and many of Betts Villians Old Fort fellas ladies as well and guys working summer jobs there in the old brick plant Basic Incorporated, many years successful in this area. Seneca County, Ohio. I guess this is our little travel log for the day. Still looking for the elusive wildlife. Kind of the wrong time of day for, for many. Deer and eagles and hawks and such and of course I'm very cognizant very of any traffic you may notice in the rear view mirror and side to side and left and right absolutely no traffic my eyes are always moving whether or not the screen shows it I figured it up a very ingenious way to do more recording at a much safer way and there's the Stanley Miller farm went to school with several of the Miller family good folks Stanley and Mercedes Miller And I'm almost home. Just sharing this little travel log with you. Oh, 
only traffic I've seen way up in the distance there you might have seen cross our path going east on County Road 61 I believe it would be toward Old Fort as we turn toward Bettsville and again our friends the Millers so we're about ready to wrap her up here just about home and dive into my day and still having the hope of maybe seeing some wildlife but we're starting to run out of road here before we get home as I started out saying it's just awesome having these windows down and the heater on a little higher and taking in the quietness of winter yes sir yes -um. Just no critters to be seen today. Not all that cold. I think it's just above freezing would be my guess. Switch screens here in a minute and I'll find out. But Anyway, that's Northwest Ohio, January 21st, 2015. Early morning. Pushing toward 8 o'clock now. Early morning. And going to sign out, no critters to be seen, so travel on, travel safely, I know I will.